the Twilight Zone meets Trios of Horror. There's sci-fi flair. Mark, tell me about the origins. Years ago, we introduced the concept of the title zone, but it was sort of a, a button at the end of an episode. It's kind of a gag. And the show's already weird. So, you know, we hit a ceiling of weird. So like the, the title zone, like actually gave us a little saw to cut a hole in that ceiling of weird so that we could like yeah, go with that. You know. Ooh, there's a lot of stuff up here. It's, yeah, we could be even weirder. <laughs> 1999, you know, SpongeBob is focused on SpongeBob. It's, you know, if, uh, if if we even had like 15 seconds without SpongeBob on screen, someone would go, um, could we get some more SpongeBob right here? Because we're a little light on SpongeBob. But over the 20 years, you know, Steve designed these characters so well that they've all grown places in people's hearts. They're, you know, Squidward freaks. They're even Squilliam freaks. I, I don't understand them, but I don't, I don't blame them for liking him. I just don't know what they like. But <laughs> Fancy living, that fancy living sort of vibe. Yeah.